So hello guys, so hello guys, welcome to my channel. So today I'm gonna be talking about a laptop which I found on Amazon. It's a very good deal. I liked it a lot. So it's called Asus Def Gaming A15. It's a 15.6 inch laptop. It is 39.62 centimeters from uh, top to bottom. It has FHD. It has 144 hertz. So if you compare it to HP Victor's laptop, it has a bit higher refresh rate. So the gaming will be smoother. So it has AMD Ryzen 5 4600H. So there's a difference between U processor and H. U is made for simple tasks such as uh, browsing, watching YouTube videos, doing simple tasks, checking mail. But H is made for uh, processes like uh, gay, high end gaming, gaming, also video editing, higher benchmarks, all those things. It has a 15.6 inch FST IPS level anti glare plane. So, what basically anti glare is in glossy displays, you can see the reflection of light that can uh, cause trouble in gaming. So, it can reduce that by anti glare display. It has 8 GB memory, which is kind of less for gaming. If you want optimum performance, <coughs> you can upgrade it for a 16 GB RAM. Storage is enough to 512 GB. If you want, you can expand it. 1650 graphics card is really good. Let's talk about what games you can play or later in the video. So to speaker system with DTS software, you can't expect that good uh, sound quality. Gaming, uh, if you have a headset, it will be good. But speaker quality won't be that good. It will be fine. So it has a backlit chiclet keyboard, one zone RGB. One zone means it doesn't have many levels. It has only one type of movement. You can't make it go across or um, forward you can only one type of uh, movement and it's rgb it is a wi-fi 6 bluetooth 5.1 so the connectivity no issues and a windows 11 home so you can uh, entry level gaming as you can see because it has uh, h4600 uh, and the ryzen 5 at rtx 150 uh, processor so you can play pubg gta v dota to Valorant, Counter Strike, Global Resistance, Fortnite, League of Legends, FIFA 22, Doom Eternal, Rare, Red Dead Redemption 2, Forza Horizon 5, Shadow of Tomb Raider, Minecraft, and uh, All Sport 9, and many more. So, so as you guys know, saw, you can play all good games, like all the demanding uh, most popular games right now. So there's no issues with playing games. You'll have smooth gaming. And the thing is, if you want higher FPS, you have to buy the higher, higher, you have to buy RTX 3070, RTX 2080, or RTX 3050 laptop. <coughs> because the, uh, because in those laptops, the higher FPS can be more, but in this, you'll get 50 to 60 FPS frame rates per second. So it's okay. What else I can't have? And yeah. Store up to 32 GB. To... So as it's written here, it supports up to 2 terabyte SSD. That means you can expand it to 2 terabyte SSD. And it can support up to 32 GB. It has 8. You can put 16 or 32 GBs. So expandability, no issues. Full nice gaming. And also the thermals are really good in this. It has smart self-cleaning 2.0, DOB technology, 83 blade fans. So it has a honeycomb pattern on the back of the laptop so that the airflow is uh, uh, reduced. And it has two fans inside and the thermals are planned really well. So a really good laptop. If you're trying to find a laptop under 60 with very good specs, like almost better than HP Victus, you know, if you like more refresh rate, you can buy this one. So as I was, was telling you that uh, this was a good deal, I was comparing to Victus. So let me tell you what are the differences. In HP Victus laptop, you almost get the same processor, but the processor is slight better, but not much difference in the performance of gaming. It has a bigger screen. Uh, if you play like a big, if you play God of War, if you want to see the characters bigger, you can. Uh, uh, use this laptop 
but if you play like valorant uh, so big screen is not needed it has 8 gb ram 512 gb as uh, same as the asus stuff gaming it has blacklit keyboard it doesn't have rgb type of keyboard so if you are uh, you know you want to show it off to your friends or uh show show it off to everyone you can buy the asus stuff it, uh, it is having rgb so as you can these the specs are uh, almost similar and hp vectors doesn't give you dedicated graphics card but you get 4 gb dedicated rtx 1650 so asus Steph gaming laptop is way better than hp vectors <laughs>